Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Sagittarius, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Sagittarius. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Cups, and this is Water Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio Energy. So this is an energy of somebody who is quite confused at this time. I'm seeing someone who's feeling very overwhelmed emotionally. Um, this person is even distracted, is what I'm seeing right now. It's like they're not really seeing the, the situation clearly. There is a sense of them almost being present but not available because of this. Um, I'm just seeing a very chaotic, confusing energy around this person. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this Sagittarius. Okay, so the first card we have is the Eight of Wands and this is Fire Energy. Next, we have the Ace of Swords, Air Energy. And finally, we have the King of Swords, Air Energy. Okay, so you could be demanding answers from this person. There is a sense of you wanting mental clarity when it comes to the situation. This person could have left you confused quite often. And with you showing up as the King of Swords, I do see that as you putting up boundaries, you trying to figure something out with this person, you demanding the truth, the direct truth, and initiating some sort of communication with this person, with that Ace of Swords there. Um, there is a sense of you, you know, really searching for that truth here. And with the Eight of Wands, I do see this person cooperating. I see this person reciproc reciprocating that communication because we're seeing back and forth communication. So there is a sense you'll be in contact with this person, but I, I see you not falling for, um, you know, any illusions or um, deception or confusions. It's, it, there's a sense of you demanding clarity, truth, and not settling for less than that. Um, and with the King of Swords, you are coming across as quite tough, um, quite self-assured at this time. You're definitely not going to play any games here. There's the sense of, you know, a, a no-nonsense attitude that you are um you know showing towards this person because this person i do see them as somebody who um you know th th there's just something about their energy it's like they haven't been very clear with you and um you're you're really in search of that clarity so let's clarify these cards sagittarius At the bottom of the deck, we have the Page of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is an energy, I'm seeing here a sense of, um, you know, your opportunities, um, putting in effort, um, somebody extending themselves in a way that is a bit uncomfortable for them, but they're doing it nonetheless. So I do see um, you may be getting some sort of message from this person, but reliable communication with this pentacles energy. It's like this person, they will try to explain something to you um, honestly, truthfully, and, um, you know, with some, some sort of backable um, energy here. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this Sagittarius. Okay, so the first card we have is the Two of Wands, and this is Fire Energy. Next, we have the Ten of Pentacles, Earth Energy. And finally, we have the Emperor, Aries Energy. 
Okay, so I do see you will be getting some answers out of this person. This person is going to meet you at that King of Swords level. They will be meeting you with integrity. With the Emperor showing up here, I do see um, something you're saying to this person or some honest communication that you're having with this person is inspiring them to be more integrous towards you, more honest with you. Um, this person is definitely going to speak their truth to you. And also, I do see a shared compassion between you. Um, this is definitely a sense of this person is going to extend themselves. There is something this person, they haven't been fully upfront with you about because they've been uncomfortable or afraid of expressing something to you. But at the Page of Pentacles, I do see that they will be expressing it to you. They will be coming more direct. Um, this is somebody who also believes in this connection. With the Ten of Pentacles, they do actually want a long-term relationship with you. This is somebody who, um, you know, does want something serious, stable, committed with you. Um, they do value your connection. I do see them also seeing you as the ideal partner. This person does want that happily ever after with you. Um, but I do see there's some things that this person needs to first clear the air about with you. They need to express something to you first. But this person, I do see them with this two of wands. It's like they have plans for the connection with you. They do think about a long term with you. Um, and I, I do see this person um, wanting to level up the connection with that emperor energy. They also want to... They want to be more honest, more straightforward with you. And I do see that this is something that is coming after you've almost pushed them to, to be more honest with you. Um, you're initiating some sort of truthful conversation and they, they're going to meet you at that level. I do see this person, if you have these high standards with this King of Swords, these standards about wanting truth, wanting people who only have good integrity when dealing with you in romantic context, this person is going to rise to meet you at that level. So I do see that this person won't drop the ball. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Sagittarius. So the card says, surrender to the divine, full moon. Okay, so with this energy, I do see that you won't have to press this person too hard. I do see that they will be um, coming clean, being open with you. Um, I do see you just initiating some sort of communication with them and um, clearly expressing to them what you want and the truth that you want. And I, I see them taking it from there. This person, they, their intentions is to be honest with you, to open up to you. Because this is someone who sees a future with you. They see this Ten of Pentacles with you. They see you guys being in the partnership together. Um, even having some sort of a legacy. This person has big dreams for this connection. Big goals. Very ambitious hopes for the connection. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you, Sagittarius. So the card says, very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Okay, so this person definitely, I, I'm seeing that it won't be long before they, um, you know, give you this clarity, um, you know, take a step back from this confusion. Um, and I do see this is a result of you being clear about what you want to know from them or, you know, what your, your, your standards are, your boundaries, something you're communicating here very sternly with this King of Swords. It, it is inspiring this person to come towards you with an, an integrous energy. And um, I do see them, you know, rising to that level. You'll be getting truth from this person and you won't even have to, you know, I'm saying you won't have to chase or force it. You just have to initiate this communication. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you, Sagittarius. So the card says, love at first sight and proud spirits. When I saw you, I fell in love and you smiled because you knew. 
Okay, so this person definitely has love for you. Um, this is somebody who, you know, sees you as the one they want to be with for. With that 10 of pentacles, they definitely do see you as, you know, someone they want to be with for a very, very long time. They may even picture themselves having a family with you starting you know it's like they see a power couple type of energy when they look at you this is somebody who with that seven of cups energy and this love at first sight energy they they may have felt this from the first time they even met you because there is a sense of a dreamy energy with that seven of cups this person is a, is a believer of love they are a hopeless romantic um there is that element to them but I also do see some for some reason this person has left you confused in some areas and there's some truths that need to be cleared up with them. And I do see them doing that very soon. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Sagittarius. I hope you have a really, really good day, Sagittarius. Bye, Sagittarius.